Hey, beautiful people, this is Janine Z, and welcome to Chic Confidence, where you grow in style and grow in confidence. Today's video is going to be about me designing a capsule wardrobe around denim. I am a person who likes to wear my whole wardrobe. The reason I create a capsule wardrobe is for me to know that this is a capsule that I'm going to choose from when I am styling my clothes, meaning I wanna make sure I include these pieces into my daily outfits, my daily looks. And so let's get started with that, item number one. So the first item I'm pulling out for my capsule is denim dresses. Denim dresses are definitely trending right now. Denim in itself is trending in almost every way that you can style it, think about it, look at it. Is trending right now and so denim is something I have a lot of in my wardrobe it's just a fabric that I really enjoy and so I pulled out these two denim dresses I absolutely love them I think they are so fun to wear this one is a little bit more girlier this is a little bit more sexier but these are the two denim dresses that I'm going to be wearing this upcoming season let's move to the next thing the next thing that I picked up with this kind of houndstooth or check blazer. This is something that is really great when you're moving into spring. I also really just love brown for blues. And let me just talk about that because I am someone who I pick my color palette and then I pick around my color palette, the items that I want to choose. So that's something that you could do. So my color palette for this bit of clothing that I'm going to show you is going to be blues, browns, blacks, beiges, whites, silvers, because silver is really trending right now. And then I'm going to have as my print, it's going to be checks. This might be patchwork. I don't have anything patchwork right now, but I'm looking at some stuff because I love patchwork just for something fun, but still in that color palette. And then leopard, because leopard again is a brown, it's nice and it just works. And as you can see, I'm wearing something brown and blue because I really do just like brown and blues together. But let's talk about this blazer. I love this blazer. The blazers are great for throwing over something like that, like fitted bodycon denim dress. It's perfect for that. If you're not the type of person who wants to be all out there, I'm not. And so having something like this that allows me to be sexy but classy with it is my thing. And so I really love something like this. A leather blazer is just to me a must. It's something that I just really, really, really want to have in my wardrobe at all times. And I've had one for years. This one came from Mango. The quality of it is great. And you are going to see me get so much use out of it in the upcoming year because I just think it's something that is so essential to have. The next three things are pretty much the same thing. It's a black ribbed tank top. I just feel like every girl needs a black ribbed tank top during this upcoming year. It just looks chic. It's simple, but it always looks chic. So I have three. I have this cropped one. I love this one. I got this from H&M. I have a regular tank top. This one came from Mango. And this one came from Shein. And this is a tank top that have a little bit of interest to it with an interesting like cutout detail here um, below the neckline. But it doesn't really matter what version of tank top that you get. But I think having some kind of black tank top to go with your denims, if you want that chic look, if you want to put on like that black leather jacket, this tank top, some jeans and black sandals or black boots, you look together and it wasn't hard to do. And so I feel like having black tank tops is really necessary for something like that. If I'm wearing denim, I feel like a denim shirt is an essential. So, so far I've mentioned two essentials. I've mentioned the leather jacket and then I mentioned this denim shirt. Girl, you need a denim shirt. It's just something that I feel like you can get so much use out of so much of the time. And so a leather jacket, a denim shirt, definitely a must for the upcoming season. Now the next tank top I have is this one here. This is a beige or nude tank top. And this is when you don't want to wear black and you want something that is gonna brighten and lighten up your mood. You don't want the darkness of black. I like having something like this. This one's cropped. Yours does not have to be cropped. It could be full length, but just having something in this type of neutral shade that's a tank top, I just think is really essential. I like that this fits close to the body, but depending on your body shape and also your comfort level, you can get a looser tank top and look just as good. And so just figure it out, but I love having a neutral shade in my capsule. So the next thing I have are crop jeans. I have 
a black pair, I have a lighter shade pair, and then I have this like darker colored pair. So I feel like really with jeans, you only need like three, maybe white if you wanna have a four. These are really the only colors you will ever need really. And everything else is just fun and bonus, but these are the essentials. I also have wide leg jeans because I'm a wide leg jean person, but having something like this for me to style my denim looks with, I just think are essential. And so I have all three and I will be wearing all three. You'll see me style them. So these are the wide leg jeans that I was talking about. Obviously blue is the one that I'm actually wearing. And so that's one. But the other two colors I have is black and this creamy kind of off-white color. This makes up everything that I have as essentials as far as clothes are concerned. Now it's on to bags. So this may look like a bit much, but for me, it isn't. I'm going to definitely wear all of these, style all of these. But these are the colors that I was talking about. So the first bag I have is this one. This is the Michael Kors Piper bag. I love this because it has a silver or gunmetal detail. And as I told you before, those silvers, that's the kind of thing that's trending right now. It's really about the silvers, not so much about the golds. I'm still going to wear both because I love both and I feel like certain things and outfits look best depending on which metal you're wearing. But I love this bag in particular to nod toward that trend. The next one is this coach bag. I love wearing this bag all times of year, but I just really like it when I'm thinking about denims and browns and blues. I'm pretty sure that you can see this against me and you can see like how it would work with even what I have on. Even though I'm wearing something printed, it would add a little bit of interest. So I really enjoyed this bag for that. I am someone who likes logo printed bags. I don't really like it in clothes and shoes and anything else, but I do like it in bags because I do wear a lot of solid prints. And when you're someone who wears a lot of solid prints, something with the print and the tones that you wear just adds a little bit of something to your looks. The next bag I have is this bag by Emporio Armani. I love this because it's a beige color. And like I said, it's going to be the lighter tone when I want to wear those brighter type of denim looks. I'm going to pull out this type of bag. I actually love that this particular bag has Emporio Armani in a navy color. And so it still looks really good with your blues and your denims. So if I wanted to wear it crossbody, I would wear it with this. If I just wanted to simplify the look, I would just take the crossbody strap off and do it that way. But I really just love this when I'm talking about building a denim capsule wardrobe. Next is this white bag. I love this. This is again, like a white black trimmed and gunmetal bag. This bag came from Carl Lagerfeld. I just love the handle of it. I find it really interesting, but I love this when I'm doing denim and white looks. Sometimes I just like that denim and white. And this is the bag that I would reach for for those looks. But I would also reach for this if I'm doing an all black denim look and I want a white contrast because I love that too. I love when white pops against black. Love that. So this is a bag that's also a part of my capsule wardrobe for denim. And finally, I have a leopard bag. I love leopard, period. It's just a print that will always be a part of my wardrobe. I consider it a staple. I know that it goes in and out of trend. Currently, right now, it's trending. But even if it wasn't trending, this is the type of bag that would be in my wardrobe all the time. And I would love this for a all blue denim outfit. And then this is just like the pop. I just think that is just a little bit fun and sexy and interesting. I would even wear this with like a white denim and a black button up and then this is a pop again. It just gives you that. Like I said, printed things just give you that pop and so I love it. Okay, on to shoes. This is the only pair of boots that are a part of my capsule wardrobe. A black leather ankle boot. What would also work but I don't own is a black western boot, like cowboy style boot. I think that would be really cute because it would add a little bit of jazziness to your outfit. This is more of a, this option is a more of a classic chic option, which is really my style and my vibe. And so I have this one, but I like that western one too. And so either one of those would work. But having some kind of black ankle or calf length boot, I think is really great for the upcoming season. I have two pairs of pumps. I have these silver pumps from Shein and these white pumps for INC. These are the main two that I'm thinking about wearing for the upcoming season and adding to looks. I love silver because silver is trending and it's just such a glam moment. So a silver pump is just it for me. 
but white pumps also give you that freshness that you need when you're going into like spring days and so i also wanted to pull out a white pump as an essential so these are the two that i'm going with for this capsule all the sandals i put pulled out are sandals heels I'm a heel person. If you are a flat person, just think flats. Now, the sandals that I'm wearing now, let's just start with that. The sandals that I'm wearing now are just brown neutral sandals. And I like something like this, some kind of skin tone sandal, because I feel like it's essential to have something that just serves as a nude for you. And for us as black women, some kind of cognac sandal typically does that really well. Here is a darker brown. So if I don't wanna have a skin tone, I have this one from Massimo Duty. This heel is really low, so it's not you know anything crazy. It's a simple um, sandal, it has woven detail. That's another thing you see trending, woven little details. This type of woven detailed brown sandal is something that I felt like was an essential for my capsule wardrobe. Another thing I like to have is a bait sandal. Now this one is from Calvin Klein. Again, this is the thing that I'm going to be wearing with lighter, brighter looks. And so I needed this. This one also really goes well with the beige bag that I have. So you'll see me pull that bag out and use the shoe and that bag to ground my looks. And so I love just having this type of thing in my wardrobe. My last two sandals are black. Of course, they're the staple ones. This one's from Coach. It has a chunky heel. This one is from Mango. It's more of a mule than a typical sandal and it has a rather low heel. So it's very comfortable to walk in. Both of them are. One because of the chunkiness of the heel and the other one because of the lowness of the heel. But the main point is having a basic black sandal is just a must. And so whether you go with something chunkier or something like this or even something that has a platform on it, which is trending right now, do what you want to do but just have some kind of black sandal in your wardrobe i feel like that's an essential so yeah i think that's the third essential that i mentioned in this video the first one being the leather jacket the second one being the denim shirt and the third being a black pair of sandals okay the final thing i have is a pair of tortoiseshell sunglasses now in my opinion brown sunglasses are the sunglasses that really really look good with denim like I said, I just really enjoy brown and blue together. And I just feel like tortoiseshell is just one of those essential pieces of sunglasses that every person needs. So if you have a black pair, I would definitely go for a tortoiseshell pair as the second pair that you love. Well, beautiful people, I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you found it helpful and could easily kind of figure out how to incorporate some pieces you have in your wardrobe and some of the ideas that I mentioned into your own wardrobe. Going forward, I will be styling these pieces, so you will definitely see them styled. If you want a sneak peek on my style, just check me out on Instagram. I style pieces almost daily there, if not daily, every other day. Again, I am Janine Z, and welcome to Chic Confidence, where you grow in style and grow in confidence. You have a great day. Bye-bye.